So you ask a simple question. Invisibility. Just decades away, we will have something resembling Harry Potter's invisibility cloak. Something equally astonishing is <clears throat> shape-shifting. When you see science fiction movies like Terminator 2, and you see the evil robot turn into jelly and then moo ooze its way through obstacles, you say to yourself, no way. No way could that happen. Believe it or not, we scientists are making huge inroads into that area. It's called programmable matter. Matter itself that could rearrange itself, change color, change shape, change conductivity by pushing a button. And here's how it works. Why is it that certain substances can, can turn liquid and ooze its way across the room like in the movie Terminator 2? It's because of atoms. Atoms can slide over atoms, rearrange themselves. But what happens if atoms are replaced by chips? Chips that are so small, they're smaller than the head of a pin. And you can change their electric charge. By changing the electric charge, they bind and reform in different ways. And they're intelligent because each dot is a computer chip, perhaps as powerful as a PC. These are called CADAMs. And who's pushing this technology? The Intel Corporation the makers of the famous Pentium chip that drives your laptop. The same company is now investigating the next several steps in the future, the ability to have programmable matter. Now think about it. It means that if I have a clump of clay made out of thousands of millions of little dots, I push a button, then the charges rearrange themselves to form a statue, a car, whatever you want. This means that I can push another button and this clay turns into a house. Or I push another button and a whole city. A whole city rises out of the desert. Sounds like science fiction, but the basic steps are being done today. And in fact, with the television crew, I went to Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh and photographed it. Of course, these catoms are quite large. They're about the size of a head of a pin, but it's only a matter of time before these catoms become so microscopic and so powerful that they'll be able to rearrange just like what you see in Terminator 2, just like what you see, what you see in the Transformers, just like what you see in X-Men comics.